Welcome back to Get Sticky TV, and today we have Florida rapper Roly Bands. Roly Bands was shot and killed outside of his apartment complex. The whole situation was stemmed from an argument he had had with one of his so-called friends online. Roly Bands had basically told this guy to pull up. Here's some of the story. Top story tonight, a local rapper and father shot and killed. His girlfriend says an argument escalated to social media and that post initiated a deadly interaction. It happened at the IQ Apartments on Bruce B. Downs Boulevard in Tampa on Friday. Tonight, 10 Tampa Bay's Angelina Salcido spoke to his girlfriend who now says she fears for her own life. He's very funny, goofy. Friends say he was an all around good guy. He's a good rapper. He's a good friend. He's very caring. Ari Juan Williams, who was known as Roly Bands, was 27 years old when his life was taken. It breaks my heart because he doesn't, he didn't deserve to die the way he did. Stephanie Augusto, his friend in love, their kids were best friends. He was an amazing dad. He was like my soulmate. That was like my best friend. He called me every day. I called him every day. I knew something was up when I, I was just having a bad feeling and he kept on telling me that he was arguing with some somebody. Hillsborough County deputies were called to the area near the IQ apartments just after 3.30 last Friday. Investigators say whoever pulled the trigger sped away from the scene and the shooting didn't seem to be random. Augusto says Ari knew his killer and they were friends. And they started arguing again and brought it to social media when it shouldn't have it shouldn't have got that far. Now Ari leaves behind his six-year-old daughter, Kashmir. While officials investigate, his family fears for their safety. Augusto hopes whoever killed him is found quickly. I hope they rot in that prison, honestly. Gun violence is not the answer. She wants the community to remember this local rapper. I want him to be remembered as a good father, a loving friend, just by him and from Roly Bands and his music. In Tampa, Angelina Salcido, 10 Tampa Bay. Well, as the story goes, Roly Bands was in to it with one of his friends over some type of tax invasion case. These guys were basically doing some type of scheme to file taxes and to gain some money. They caught one of the guys. First, here's the first guy. Hillsborough County tonight, a man investigators say is connected to the murder of a local rapper is now behind bars. Darren Day was arrested by U.S. Marshals in Lee County for first degree murder. Ari Juwan Williams, known as Roly Bands, was shot outside his Tampa apartment complex on July 22nd. Deputies say that the shooter then drove off. Williams' friend told us at the time that Williams knew his killer. They were arguing on social media apparently before this shooting. During this initial investigation, once that guy was locked up, they had continued on with the investigation, and it seems a guy by the name of Demon Speed was the actual shooter. Here's some of that story of catching up with Demon Speed. And charged in the murder of a local rapper are set to face a judge. Demon Speed and Darren Day are accused of killing Ari Williams, also known as Roly Bands. It happened outside the IQ Apartments in Tampa on July 22nd. Well, it seems that De De Damon, it sounds like demon to me, Damon Speed had gotten to an altercation with Roly Bands on social media. And Roly Bands had basically told Damon to pull up. Once he told Damon to pull up, a few minutes later, Damon actually pulled up on him and his girlfriend and opened fire, killing Roly and the killing Roly Bands. This whole thing probably could have been avoided if these two guys would have just talked it out. But ego seems like it gets in the way and people like to go on social media and say things like pull up. And when he said that, that was the last thing he ever did because five minutes later, Damon actually pulled up. Here's that story. Rapper is in jail tonight as investigators provide new evidence in court they say links him to the murder. 10 Tampa Bay Shannon Clo brings us inside that Hillsborough County courtroom. Good afternoon, Your Honor. Good afternoon. My name is Damon Speed. Are you a danger to the community or society? And I have to say yes. 
Demont Speed was just released from jail in June, but he's already back behind bars. This, as he's been there multiple times before. I also do not believe that you think the laws apply to you. About one month ago, on July 22nd, here at IQ Apartments in Tampa, Speed is accused of killing Ari Williams, known by his rapper name, Roly Bands. The victim has his hands up. He shoots the victim from the car, gets out of the car while the victim is running away. He chases the victim down, shoots him multiple times, and ends up shooting him in the back of the head and through the body, just multiple gunshot wounds. Investigators say Speed didn't act alone. Darren Day was arrested for driving the car. Both live in Fort Myers. Premeditation can happen in a matter of minutes. In this instance, it happened over a course of hours and hundreds of miles that you could have changed your mind. Inside this courtroom, we learned tax fraud links all three men. Detectives say Ari filed his sister's tax return and was going to compensate those who helped. We learned from a witness Ari and Speed were arguing. Investigators say Ari sent a text saying, pull up. A short time later, Ari was outside his apartment with his dog and girlfriend. That's when Day arrived with Speed and 13 rounds were fired. The victim did have his hands up. Um, when he was shot, and then after, even after he went down, you continue to pursue him. After the shooting, investigators say Speed paid Day $400. Speed's defense used a witness as their argument. Direct witness that a miss identified the shooter in this circumstance as someone that was not my client. Shannon Clo joins us right now. Shannon, the judge said evidence led them to believe Speed is responsible. Yeah, so there were a couple things. They were pinging his cell phone, plus they had surveillance video that put him there. And then in that surveillance video, they saw someone with tattooed arms, and both of his arms are tattooed. Got it. And we understand that you spoke with Ari's family, and this is the day they've been waiting for. Yeah, so a couple of weeks ago, they had his funeral, and they said really then they needed these arrests for the closure. So this is something they've been waiting for. And now the next steps here is August 23rd. He'll be back in court, and that's when they can kind of follow this through the court system. All right, we'll be in court as well. Yeah. All right. Well, that's all I have on Roly Bands. The two guys was convicted and sentenced to life in prison. Here's a little bit of his social media. You know, that's how I like to do. Give you guys just a little glimpse into their music and their lifestyle. Just a little bit. Roly doesn't have too much of a huge social media following, but he was well known in Florida. Like and subscribe to my channel. If you like my videos, like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and get sticky TV. It's not my place. My baby mama, she a foreigner. Fat. Took a lot of work to live how I live. You call it working hard, I call it karma. In the latest bands blowing ganja. Police get behind me, I'm a rhino. All this money on me, plus it's 30 on me. No young money, I'm a stunner. Fresh out of prison, then I powered up. Ain't loving bitches, I'm just trying to fuck. I'm Mary Jeans with a glizzy tuck. I'm swiping pieces, yeah, I'm blicky duck. Got the Thank you.